Hi, do you ever have trouble going to sleep, staying asleep all night, and waking refreshed? Then I have four simple remedy categories just for you. Hi, I'm Cheryl Townsley, naturopath and wisdom coach. And in working with clients for over 25 years, one of the most common problems is the inability to get to sleep or stay asleep. I know how thankful I am to be able to sleep all night. It's truly a gift because if you're not sleeping well, your body can't cleanse, you're not going to have energy, and your brain's going to get slow. And we don't want any of that for you. So let's look at the first list of things that you can do that are super simple. And these are things to avoid. You want to avoid drinking water in the evening. Preferably stop drinking between 6 and 7, and that will help. Now, if you're drinking your water and immediately having to go to the bathroom, or you're having to go to the bathroom to urinate at night, you may notice that you're not using your water. And how would that show up? dry skin. You pinch your skin and it takes forever to go back into place. What you want to do is add rehydrate, which is a homeopathic to help your body use water more effectively. You can find that out on our website, CherylTownsley.com. And you would just put that in the water. Never take it straight. That wouldn't do any good. So you want to avoid water. You want to avoid sugar. Sugar is one of the biggest reasons for having hot flashes, warm flushes at night. So avoid sugar, preferably all the time. If you don't know how to do that, our cookbooks will help you. But if you're going to have sugar, have it before about 2 o'clock in the afternoon. Now, if you're doing caffeine, stop caffeine before about 2 o'clock in the afternoon. <clears throat> now, the other thing to cut out is worry. Worry, worry, worry. That causes your brain to go into overdrive at night and it can't relax. Learning how to set aside your problems. In fact, I've had clients just write down their worries before they go to bed, set it on the nightstand, turn it over and go, I just release it because I'm going to rest. So those are the avoids. Now look at, let's look at strategy number two, some things that you can do. If you sit at a computer screen all day long, if you're on devices, if you're on tablets, that has an impact on the brain and therefore the nervous system and that will impact your sleep. So fashion statement here, I'm sure. These are yellow glasses and they help to negate the blue glasses. Very helpful for gamers, video gamers, anybody on computers, and you know what folks, this really impacts our children. So be aware of how much screen time they're getting instead of play time outside. So yellow glasses, which you can put over glasses or wear just plain like this, is really helpful to relax the eyes so that they don't have the impact, negative impact of the screen. Now you can do this while you're at the computer and you can play with how long it helps you. You know, in many of my other videos, I talk about range of motion and how to know if your brain likes a certain activity such as this. Now, we don't sell these, but you can go out to colorglasses.com and you can simply get the yellow glasses. If you don't want to do that, you can go out to Amazon and just look for yellow glasses or computer yellow glasses and find lots of options. In addition to that, it's very important to have your room dark. If there's any sunlight coming in or moonlight or lights from devices, then that's going to impact your body's being able to relax and produce appropriate melatonin. You want to, as much as possible, get rid of electronics in your bedroom, um, whether it's an electronic clock, um, your cell phone. We have a little battery operated clock and virtually nothing else in the bedroom. That allows the, the brain and the body to just <sighs> relax. Pay attention to your evening routine, just like with children. Learning how to relax so you can enter into rest is awesome. Now what about a few little supplements that might help you? If you have trouble getting into a deep sleep, this has become one of our very top sellers. REM for getting into deep sleep. It has tryptophan and the herbs to calm the nervous system. Somewhere between one to three, most common is two, at night, preferably two hours before you go to bed. But if you're like me, I never remember it, so I just take it before I get in bed. Seems to really help. Most people notice a difference between a day um, to maybe a week. And then they notice, wow, I'm really sleeping deep. And if they do happen to wake up, 
they just go back to sleep very easily. If you're under a lot of stress, whether it's at work, with your family, with life in general, another one of my all-time favorites, it's a homeopathic called EU Stress. You can take a dropper under the tongue anywhere from two times a day to every single hour. This really helps calm the nervous system. Now a couple of other things that can help the emotions one is if you have bad dreams, nightmares, this is true for you or children, rock rose is a flower essence that you can find in any health food store. Simply take it throughout the day and before you go to bed. Then you might also consider white chestnut. It's great for busy brain. Your brain just goes and goes and goes and goes and you don't want that when you're sleeping. So again, white chestnut found in any health food store can be taken during the day before you go to bed so you can calm the thinking. So we've looked at what to avoid. We've looked at the things that you can add. We've looked at supplements. Now I want you to know that the time you wake up tells you a whole lot. One of the classes that I have taught, creating your best 24 hour day, helps you to understand that if you're waking up between 11 to 1, ah, that might be gallbladder. 1 to 3, ah, that might be your liver. 3 to 5, lungs. And then it's going to tell you exactly what you can do for any of those organs. If you would like this, you can purchase the program, but it's so much more affordable when you're part of our easy community. Our easy community community gives you access to all of my training for a mere $20 a month. No long-term commitment. Just allows you to not only get educated, but learn how to let it be easy. Because if it's hard, the brain will repay you with stress, pain, and insomnia. So check out all the resources, including the easy program at CherylTownsley.com. It's time for you to get a good night's sleep so that you have energy all day long.